Welcome everyone, welcome to this under investigation video. Today we're looking at uh, protest number 77 of the current season. Uh, 76, sorry. Uh, this time we are in the Super Formula Challenge on last uh, Thursday's race. Uh, I believe it was round 7 at Suzuka. Um, we're on lap 22, uh, about to finish it and start lap 23. And there's a battle between those uh, two uh, gorgeous cars um, They will come together on T1 <coughs> So uh, we'll make sure we cover all the angles So that the stewards can take a proper decision, but also share a bit of my uh, perspective of the incident. So let's take a look From the fire chase camera It looks to be the battle for P13 with the car in front. Bit of a slide from the car in front. Exiting the last chicane. Looks pretty terminal for both. Okay, um, so first thing we want to take a look at is overlap. So does these cars seem pretty much in interlocked together. So entering the corner, uh, starting turning in, they have a proper overlap. So they need both need to leave each other uh, space. The green car has a very weird behavior. So let's take a look from the top view. I mean, I want to see if how much space was left. So we're on still on the racing surface and the car kind of kind of turns. Really looks like a ghost contact, unfortunately. So the, the amount of space left on the inside was very minimal, but uh, but fair, I think. So the car on the inside did not have to go on the curbs, on the rumble strip on the right side. Let's take a look from the cockpit view. I mean, I've seen enough really looks like a goals contact unfortunately so half the speed I'm pretty sure these cars don't need to brake or maybe just lift a little bit so the car on the right side had not did not change his wheel input throughout the corner, so it's not like he has a snap over steer or something like that that would have bring, brought him to the left side towards the, the next car. And yeah, it's pretty weird how the car reacts on the other side. So let's take a look from uh, the green car perspective. Both were on overtake. Defending the position, I assume this is uh, towards the end of the race. All right, I'll send this to the stewards. I mean, I have difficulty seeing something else than a racing incident here since there was so much, um, there was so much uh, net code involved. But uh, I'll submit this to the team and uh, see what they think. Have a nice day, everyone. 